Good morning. <laughs> so, okay, first off, my name is Janasia. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, then welcome back to the channel. What's poppin', what's good? So today, it is a Monday. It is the start of a new week. So we're gonna do another vlog. Let's get it. It is currently 9.16 in the a.m. And um, I'm on my way to a, like, I'm on my way to a lip training class. One of my goals this year was to start a business, um, get into like the beauty industry side of things. And so hopefully this lip class will be my intro into that and hopefully things go smoothly. Um, I am very nervous. My model this year is to do everything and anything for the plot, especially if it makes me scared or nervous just because I feel like things that make you scared or make you nervous or make you come out of your comfort zone, that's the only way that you're gonna grow. That's the only way that you're gonna elevate and figure out if you like something or don't like something, if something is for you, not for you, etc. And I'm tired of being scared. I'm tired of feeling kind of stuck, kind of like I should be doing more and yeah i am pushing past all my nervousness i am coming out of my comfort zone and i just feel like this is going to be really really good for me also i am running on like no sleep um because you know i am a night shift girly so it's very hard for me to have a regular sleep schedule so i had took a nap and i woke up from my nap what time did i wake up from that nap I don't know maybe 12 ish and I haven't been back to sleep since then <laughs> so I'm up but I'm feeling good like I feel like it's because like I'm excited and like nervous and I'm not feeling the tiredness um, I'm not sure how long this class is gonna be I'm hoping it's not too too long um, and it is a one-on-one -on -one class so it's not like I can't like you know hide in the back of the class or something like that and and especially like this is something new so i want to be awake i want to be paying attention i need to be paying attention um so i have all my little things my ipad a notebook all my little cute pens and whatnot i'm wearing a super cute pair of scrubs i'm feeling good my scrubs are from fabletics um i absolutely love this color um they're a, like a straight leg i don't know about you guys okay but i used to be really heavy into like the jogger type of scrubs and now i feel like the straight leg it just it gives more than the jogger the jogger doesn't hit like it used to so these are a pair of the new color from fabletics absolutely love them and i was going to stop and get a coffee but um my instructor texted and she asked me what my Starbucks order was. So I don't really get coffee from Starbucks, but I will drink like uh, acai. So I told her to get me one of those and then worst case scenario, take a break or go on lunch or whatever, I'll get a coffee then if I feel like I need one. So, I, the, the class starts at 10, it's 9.20 now. It says that I will arrive at 9.50. around like three 
um I had a lot of fun like it was a lot of information but she explained everything so well answered any questions I had um, I did some practicing like on the little jelly lips and tomorrow I'm going to work on a live model so that's really exciting and then tomorrow I'll get like my certificate and everything um, I didn't pull out my camera um, just because I was really paying attention to what she was saying and then I was trying to get like footage to make like a little TikTok so I have footage from that so I can kind of show you guys a little bit but this is my little box that I got it matches me how cute let me see if I can show you really quickly um, so this is everything that came in came in it um, there's some filler in there there's ampules there's my pen um, fat dissolver in there uh what else lip gloss little um lip wands there's a there's a bunch of stuff in there um it was so cute she got me a uh, starbucks in the morning and then she got me tacos for lunch and we were just chatting and vibing she was so sweet so cool like loved the whole experience i'm like super excited for tomorrow i'm feeling very confident like yeah i feel like that girl a little bit like so that's that i am just picking up um some chick-fil-a for me and rob because he hasn't ate yet and i'm hungry and i don't want to like i'm gonna cook but like i don't want to cook right now because like i'm gonna get home and I still have a few things to do like a little bit of cleaning and I want to take some pictures so I can like post on the, my business page and oh that sounds crazy to say a little bit um <laughs> but yeah so I'm getting Chick-fil-A right now and I'm really excited because I love Chick-fil-A <laughs> um what else what else what else can i tell you guys i don't know i feel like i'm really on my zoom right now like so i'm going on vacation next month on like a little three-day trip and i'm getting my hair done but i'm getting a style that i feel like okay my plan is to get uh like half tribal braids and then the rest um knotless braids and so i'm getting that for the vacation but you know i'm gonna be swimming and stuff and you know how tribal braids get anywho i'm supposed to go to a concert the following weekend and is it crazy of me to get my hair done again like i want to get one of my wigs reinstalled because i feel like it would be really cute with the outfit but then again i feel like i'm doing too much because girl you would have just gotten your hair done the week before like so like do you really need your hair done again but i feel like i kind of do need my hair done again because like it's gonna be messy from the vacation <laughs> i don't know i feel like i'm just trying to find an excuse but i feel like the, the excuse is valid Hello, can I get a Hi. Order? um i believe it's under j pickup order, order. yeah is it janessia j yeah okay you're all set thank you my pleasure um yeah but i don't know like do you guys get what i'm trying to say do you feel me because like i don't want to go to the concert and then my braids is looking all dusty crusty from being in the ocean and whatnot like it's not like i have to buy a new wig i would just have to get it reinstalled anywho the plan for the rest of the day i'm chilling like I said, I'm gonna cook. Well, I have leftovers from my mom's house, like mac and cheese and rice. So I just plan to like make some fish to eat with the mac and cheese and rice. And I feel like that would be good. But I'm gonna eat the Chick-fil-A right now. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna clean the house because it needs to be cleaned. I'm gonna start the week off fresh. I didn't do that yesterday because I was too tired and we was at mom's house. But um yeah i'm gonna start the week off fresh clean to the tea um yeah 
I'm gonna try to record tomorrow because since my mom is the model, I feel comfortable like recording and you know whatnot. So I will try to remember to record on my camera, but it's hard because I'm trying to record content on my phone, record content on the camera, and then my trainer is also trying to record content for her business page, and so it's just like it'd be a lot sometimes. <laughs> so just bear with me, y'all. But um, yeah, it's been a really good day. It's beautiful outside. The sun is shining. But I do need a nap. <laughs> but then I can't even. I can't even take a nap. Because if I take a nap, then I'm gonna be up all night again, and I have to be back for training at 9 a.m. Again, no, no, 10. I have to be back for training at 10 again. Alright guys, I am securing my Chick-fil-A package and so I will talk to you when I talk to you. Good morning, it is day two of training. I am on my way um, to Duncan first because um, I actually have a little bit of time to stop. And I definitely feel like I'm needing a coffee this morning. Um, so I placed my order. My order came out, my total came out to 888 today, which is an angel number. And we need to see what exactly that angel number means. I don't always see 888 often. Um, I usually see like 222, 555. Um, I'll see 333 from time to time um, but usually I'll see like the twos and the fives a lot so let's see what the eights mean so it says 888 is often associated with abundant success and financial prosperity it is considered the number it is considered a symbol of balance material wealth achievement and manifestation of goals I'm rocking with that. <laughs> I'm rocking with that for sure. So yesterday, I didn't even end up cooking um, because I was just so exhausted. And I was still full. Like, so what happened? Um, took pictures, ate, took a shower. No. Eight, took pictures, cleaned the house a little bit, took a shower and lay down. And when I finally laid down, it was already like eight something, almost nine. And I had still not slept at all. So I like passed out as soon as I put my phone down. Since I had fell asleep so early, I did wake up like around two and then again at four. Um, and then I was kind of up for a little bit, but I kind of forced myself to go back to sleep. But the pictures I took yesterday came out so cute. Rob took them for me and we just did them like at the house like in front of a white wall but let me show you guys or try to show you guys like they came out super cute okay anywho uh, I'm just about to get my coffee and uh, my little breakfast sandwich and today um, we're just gonna go over like an overview of everything that we did yesterday do like a quick refresher and Then I will do my live model and I won't be there um, Only supposed to be there till around like 12 ish um, Because I also have a work training like at my hospital job that I need to go to that's from like 1 to 6 which is like insane um, <laughs> So I have to do that as well and it's just a training day. It's a training day today, so bear with me.
it is another beautiful day in florida <laughs> um today is actually nail day um i do work later unfortunately but um i'm going to get my nails done because i'm just sick and tired of this style that i have going on i'm going back to my little french tips um yeah so i am just getting ready for that i have a few outfits that i got from the tiktok shop and um they're just like little chill outfits so i'm gonna try all three of them on and see which one i really want to wear so this is outfit number one i really 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 love the open back on this like I, it's just It's giving. I feel like I love this material. It's kind of like that workout material. This will probably become one of my workout outfits, not gonna lie. Um, but love this. I don't really have anything in this color, um, which is why I got it, but so pretty. And I like that um, the boob area has padding. So like, you know, my nips are chilling. <laughs> because I like, get a lot of my workout stuff um, they don't always come with padding so you know the girl be poking a little bit but um, I'm obsessed with this like love 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 so this is a, another one piece um, this one has a little bit of an open back as well but um, it has like the cinched or what do you call it cinched Wrenched, whatever you call it, you know, little area on the back right there, and um, it makes the body look good, okay? Body is tea, so I'm not like, like, girl, I have like just no words, no words at all. I really like the color of this one, um, you know, a color, this color, all color goes with everything. Um, this also has the padding like in the boot area. Like I said, y'all see it. Y'all see it. <laughs> but also, I've really been liking like the open like bell bottom pants. Um, it just, it feels more comfortable to me. I feel like it's been looking better in my opinion. Um, don't get me wrong, I still like, you know, my leggings and things like that, but lately, the, the looser bell bottom has been hitting me. really like this one too. I give this a 10 out of 10. Just period, 10 out of 10. It's that stretchy material as well. Um, also, everything that I'm trying on, I got it in a size small, in case you guys are wondering or want to go get it yourself. Yeah. Last but not least, I have this little gray two-piece set. Um, it's one of those like kind of like a yoga pants sets where they have like the flip down type of <laughs> um, thing going on. Um, I've been wanting a set like this for a while and um, I finally got my hands on one. They were always like sold out or whatever the case is. Um, now it is getting to be summertime and I know like long sleeves and blah 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 but um I feel like on those colder mornings are nice where you're running errands like right now um it is a little chilly this morning um but you know Florida gets hot later on in the day but I should be home by then and honestly it gets really chilly in um my nail techs suite so I feel like I'm gonna wear this today because the material, honestly, it's not too thick, it's not too thin, it's like perfect. And I'm very comfy. Once again, the little loose bottoms. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna put this on. Very chill. If you guys are wanting the links to anything, they will all be in my TikTok shop. So make sure you guys are following me on there and um, get your one. <laughs> Don't hate me. <laughs> I forgot to take my camera with me to my nail appointment. 
Um, so I don't have footage from that. <laughs> but um, after my nail appointment, I went and got some Chipotle and I've been laying down just mentally preparing for my shift tonight. And so I'm actually pushing it on time. It is currently 5.30. Um, I usually get ready way, way before this, but I just, I was in, I did not feel like getting up. I'm putting a pimple patch on because my friend right there is uh, booming. Anywho, I'm already about to throw my scrubs on. I'm just gonna eat my leftover Chipotle. I was gonna go to my mom's house because she was cooking, but I was being too lazy. And I still need to go get my coffee. So, uh, yeah. Anywho, you know, throw my scrubs on and get out the door because uh, I do not have time to be lollygagging for real. But here, but yeah, here I am, lollygagging. I hope it's a good shift. I really don't want to go today. But I'm off tomorrow and then on for two again. So. We're in the car now, and I need to get going. It's 6.09, so I'm not doing bed on time. My coffee looks freaking amazing today. Um, yeah. That's so good. <laughs> I haven't had a coffee in a little minute. I haven't had a coffee since the last time I went to work and that it's been like four days? Has it been four days? It feels like it's been like four days. Wow, that's amazing. That's so freaking good. Okay. Anywho, I don't remember if I showed you guys. Did I show you guys my nails? I don't know. But anyways, here are my nails. Very uh Spring, Easter, pastelli, yeah, that's the vibes. I really don't know what's up with me today, but I, I'm, I don't, I, I feel off. Like something feels off, and I can't really put my finger on what's wrong. But uh, I'm kind of in a little mood, not like a grumpy bad mood, but like uh, something just feels off, I don't know. So I'm going to take this time on my way to work to meditate and just try to get centered and get myself together because my vibe is not vibing. <laughs> so, anywho, I will get in touch with y'all in the morning. It may not mean nothing to y'all. Understand nothing was done for me. So, I don't plan on stopping at all. I want this shit forever, mine, ever, mine, ever, mine. Shut your shit down in the mall. Sunday, girl, she the one for me And I ain't even planning the call I want this shit forever, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Last name ever, first name greatest Like a sprained ankle, boy, ain't nothing to play with Started off local, but thanks to all the haters I know G4 pilots on a first name basis In your city, faded off the ground Nino, she insists she got more class We know, swimming in the money, come and find me Nemo, if I was at the club, you know Chug, 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 brother You got a chug, brother? Chug, brother? Chug, 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 fucking chug. Sorry for my language. Chug, chug, brother. <laughs> chug, 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 brother. Chug, brother. Chug. Keep chugging, brother. You're a natural, brother. 
Charles, no, 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 stop, brother. It got cold. He said, Willie Grouse said, it's gonna be freezing. <laughs> oh my god. I got a lazy. I've been drinking. No, no cameras. Paparazzi, stop! Paparazzi. I like your dog. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Rob gets you'll get real friendly when you're drunk. <laughs> Come in, brother. Hello, how's it going? How's it going? Stop. Stop telling me what to do. <laughs> because leave those people alone. What is wrong with you? I want to talk to them network. <laughs> he, he does, but leave people alone. Know, maybe he could give me a Fortune 500 company. I could be like a princess. No. You got that man alone. It may not mean nothing to y'all. Got an attitude, but you got to say so I ain't mad at you. Go from vibey to like <laughs> singing shit. You got now you gotta up the pace. So you gotta play some other shit. Nah, bro. Nah, I'm trying to dodge the sin. Just walk out the lavish stove, pay a shoe, 1250. You want to boss up your life? All you gotta do is get in with me. Okay. It is currently 6.07 on a Saturday. And I am headed into work, sadly. <laughs> um, so I haven't talked, I feel like, in a little minute um, or updated you guys. So I missed the day yesterday. I didn't do anything because um, I worked last night. So I literally slept until it was pretty much time to go to work. And. I was actually in a great mood yesterday, like such a great mood. I didn't even stop to get coffee or anything. Like I was running off vibes, like great vibes, okay? And um, I got to work and it was an absolute shit show. Like I should have got coffee. So, but the fact of that, oh, it's very bright. The fact that I was just in a wonderful mood overall, like, it kept me alive, it kept me in good spirits, but today I'm stopping to get coffee because I was exhausted yesterday, and who knows what tonight is going to be like. I'm not taking the chance, I need to be extra caffeinated, I need to be prepared, so we're getting coffee. I haven't ate anything yet, so I need to get my life together and I don't even know I'm gonna if I'm I don't even know if I'm gonna have time to stop take anything to eat let alone eat it so that was the last thing that I showed before that oh the last thing that I showed was um going out um on my day off and having drinks and vibing and eating and chilling um actually you know small wins and I'm gonna continue to celebrate my small wins and life has been good good things have been happening um, so yeah we're just in a very celebratory mood I suppose I hit 20k on my nurse page which is a small win but like still big because like it's 20k who would have thought like things are being what they are right now like i always knew okay like 20k 
is a small win but also a big win in a sense because just like I kind of knew that if I applied myself a little bit more and be more consistent with content and things that it would show off um like results would show but like at the same time it's still kind of shocking because it's like who would have thought like that this is for real <laughs> i don't know like it's just strange to see like people at my job are always telling me like you popped up on my for you page or i see you on instagram all the time or like my family members that don't even have nurse content at all or anything like that or just random people who don't have nurse content they reach out to me and they're like girl you're popping up on my for you page all the time um or just things like that and like you know they give their flowers and <sighs> it's just a very like heartwarming shocking surreal feeling you know yeah anywho let me go inside get my coffee and um we'll need to go get something to eat because i need to be i don't need to be passing out you know so yeah yeah that's amazing that's a really good coffee today <laughs> so i'll give him his props okay now we're gonna have to rush to some type of fast food um it's most likely gonna be wendy's because that's like a, that's a very close to my job taco bell do i want taco bell do i want taco bell no i don't actually okay <laughs> anywho i'm gonna figure out what i'm gonna eat and i will chat with you guys tomorrow tomorrow will be the last day of the week of my life um and honestly i'm gonna spend the sunday to relax and sleep and probably binge watch tv so it won't be anything too interesting but um yeah i'll talk to you guys in the morning hi guys so it is a new week <laughs> but as i'm watching the footage i realized that i never came back for my final day and did like an outro or anything like that i really should have just ended the vlog that day because i i just knew that i was gonna come home after work and be lazy which i did so that final day of the week of my life i literally slept all day and rotted in bed so <laughs> there wasn't really much to show you or much to talk about um so i'm just coming on now to do an outro um but so much has happened since then like it's been i don't even know how long it's been it's been a few weeks actually um one new thing i adopted a cat okay it's okay mommy this is Zaya my mom and brother adopted her but weren't able to keep her so I took over and I am now mommy she doesn't really like to be picked up so that's why she's doing all this go ahead so yes that's Zaya and I love her to pieces. She is such a girl's girl. Well, she's my girl. We're like twinsies. Her attitude is something else, let me tell you. But um <laughs> I love her to death. I really have enjoyed like having a cat. But um as you guys seen in this vlog, I did my lip class. So I bought a bunch of stuff to you know start the business and that's in process i made the business page um i haven't really posted on there yet because i'm still getting things in motion i'm going to be taking models soon so what else just just a lot of really nice good things have been happening um and honestly i owe it all to god not even gonna lie like i have been um just 
trying to get closer to God. Like I grew up in church. Um, and so God is no stranger to me, but I feel like as I got older, um, I kind of veered off from that path just because being younger, it was kind of forced on to me. <laughs> um, I, like I said, I grew up in church. My grandparents are pastors and so I'm a pastor's grandchild. Um, but yeah, growing up, it was, you know, kind of forced which it wasn't bad or anything like that like i didn't not enjoy going to church or anything like that but um it just kind of like i had no choice you know what i'm saying and it's different when you're older and like you know you have a choice to pick to be spiritual or godly and things like that um and you can choose how you want to do things like that and um yeah so i have been just praying more i don't ever i've never i don't really share this publicly just because but i actually was heavily smoking marijuana and um <laughs> for a list of reasons um partially to help me sleep partially for anxiety partially for just like i said a list of things um but i felt like it got to a point where um it just it wasn't feeling good anymore and i felt like god was telling me to stop basically and to put it down and to chill and relax and um i don't want to say that i was addicted but i guess we can it was on the line i guess i had to smoke to go to sleep i felt like i wanted to smoke or just whatever um and so to get closer to God and try to be able to hear him better and keep my blessings coming. I didn't make a deal with God, but I basically made a, I made a promise to God. I made a promise to God that I was going to take a break from smoking um, to just show him my commitment to him and this process and to try to get closer to him, to try to hear him better and when i tell you that ever since i stopped smoking this man has been shown out in all aspects of my life he has been doing the most like to prove to me not even to prove to me but to show me like when you listen to him more and follow what he has to say just the things that can happen for you and i don't want to say i'm shocked because i i know that god can do many many things but like it still kind of blows my mind sometimes that just all of the things that he does do and yeah <laughs> i don't know why i just felt the need to share that but um somebody needs to hear it and i'm not sharing this to be like you need to go get right with god or i'm this you know, holy godly woman or anything like that because it's a process and um a journey and I'm online and I just wanted to share this is a week of my life I share my life on here with you guys basically and this is a part of it it's not a part that I share often um, just because it is just more private you know and um, everybody has the way they feel about God or being spiritual and things like that but um that's my truth my faith and 
I felt the need to share. <laughs> but anywho, back to me closing out the vlog. That's what I was supposed to be doing. But yeah, it's my little life. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning into this vlog. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to keep on trying to do them. And yeah, we will see what the future has to come. <laughs>